In this video, we'll discover about mental health and aging. Is there a link between mental health and aging? The answer isn't straightforward. There are various considerations when exploring this topic. Studies have shown that over 20% of people over the age of 55 in the U.S. experience one type of mental health issue or the other. The most common psychological issues among this population are anxiety, mood disorders, and severe cognitive impairment. This chapter will leverage research and anecdotal data to discuss the association between mental health and aging to give you a better insight regarding the link. Mental health is crucial. Unknown to many people, your mental health is as important as your physical health. In fact, you cannot separate the two because they affect one another in multiple ways. Moreover, some symptoms are common to both physical and mental issues. For example, loss of appetite is common in both cases. According to the World Health Organization, you are not healthy until your mental, physical, and social well-being are in good states. Poor mental health will affect your rate of healing from physical illness and also make you prone to substance abuse. So you can be confident that mental health issues will speed up the aging process, just like physical challenges. Mental health challenges aren't norms for older adults. As stated earlier, depression isn't a normal part of aging. However, depression isn't the only mental health concern that is not a norm for older adults. Anxiety disorders are also for both young and old. Indeed, research has shown that seniors are more susceptible to psychological problems. A study showed that around 6% of older adults in the U.S. have diagnosable depressive illness. Nonetheless, research shows that one in four American adults is battling one mental health concern or the other. So the issue isn't restricted to older adults. Older adults can be diagnosed and treated. One of the reasons it's essential to emphasize that mental health issues aren't normal parts of aging is so that older adults can seek solutions when they are affected. It's unfortunate that many older people are discriminated against by their loved ones instead of being supported when they are battling mental health issues. However, this is a wrong perception and approach. Younger people also suffer from the same fate. Instead of getting social support from the people around them, many are left alone to themselves. Older adults can continue to thrive and enjoy life. When they are battling a psychological issue, they should be diagnosed and treated. Mental health history doesn't matter. The fact that you have never had a mental health problem before doesn't mean that you will not have one later. Many adults go through life managing a chronic mental illness. However, it can disappear as they grow older if they have the right treatment and support. Meanwhile, an older adult who has not had a psychological issue during his or her younger years can suffer from one as he or she grows older. In some cases, physical illnesses such as stroke, cancer, and Parkinson's disease can lead to depression or any other mental issues. Older adults have the highest suicide risk. No one should ever consider taking their lives for whatever reason. Unfortunately, many people, especially older adults, commit suicide. So you need to be careful because it can happen to anyone. However, older adults are more at risk. Research has proven that people above the age of 75 have the highest suicide rate. When you notice that you've been sad for more than two weeks, you need to see a professional as soon as possible. You should also see a therapist if you have constant worries about issues such as family, money, and health. If you have someone close to you that can help out, don't hesitate to speak to him or her. Seniors need more mental health services. Despite the significant number of people battling mental health challenges, the health system has limited services for them. More than 80% of the health system is committed to treating physical illnesses. So this situation is a barrier to treating many people dealing with mental health concerns. Research has shown that more than 63% of older adults with mental health concerns don't get the services they need. Besides, around 75% of the people who have committed suicide have been to a primary care physician within a month leading up to the unfortunate event. So more needs to be done in this regard to ensure that people battling these issues can get help on time. Anxiety issues speed up aging. According to researchers, mental health issues like anxiety speeds up the aging process. Studies have proven that high levels of anxiety might make you age faster. In a particular study, the investigators observed that there is a link between phobic anxiety and shorter telomeres in middle-aged and older women. Phobic anxiety is an unreasonable fear of certain situations such as heights and crowds. Meanwhile, telomeres are caps on the ends of chromosomes, responsible for the protection of genetic material from damages. Therefore, when they start getting shorter, you are at risk of premature aging. Generally, telomeres get shorter as we grow older. This reduction is responsible for health problems such as heart disease, 
cancers, dementia, and the overall risk of death. However, researchers have found out that phobic stress can make people have shorter telomeres. Depression makes you age faster. According to researchers, depression can physically affect a person's brain. The result of this effect is that the person will become more susceptible to illnesses, which is associated with old age. Previous studies have found that depression leads to muscle pains, heightened risk of headaches, and sleep problems. A 2004 study showed that it could create a negative feedback loop. The recent studies leveraged brain imaging technology to observe how the brain changes when people are battling depression. The results showed that severe symptoms of depression affect synaptic density. This shows that those battling depression will have impaired brain activities. Meanwhile, loss of synaptic density is often found among people who are between the ages of 74 and 90. So the study showed that common byproducts of aging are also evident among people with depression. Scientists are still working on medications that can reverse the process. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.